Assalamu alaikum my dear students. How are you? I think you are all well with the grace of Almighty Allah. Welcome to NIAVS Home School. I am Muhammad Al Yamin Opu, an assistant teacher of mathematics, National Ideal English Version School, Morning Shift. Today I am going to take a mathematics class for the student of class 2. Our today's topic is ascending order. Okay, today's topic is ascending order part 2. Our today's lecture number is 10 and you have a homework. Your homework number is 7, my dear students. Okay, now I am uh, going to solve one question today and you will solve another question in your homework the question is uh, write the following numbers in ascending order okay these numbers there are five numbers that are given here and we need to arrange this five number in ascending order in the previous class you have already learned how to arrange in ascending order okay today's class is very important first of all we need to write down the record the record the required ascending order the required ascending order then colon okay we should write down here the ascending order my dear students in the ascending order we know that zero is the smallest number ascending order means what ascending order means we need to arrange the number from smaller to greater okay the smaller number is first is zero and one is greater than zero then 2 is greater than 1, then 3 is greater than 2, 4 is greater than 3, like this 5 is greater than 4, 6 is greater than 5, and 7 is greater than 6, it's 8 is greater than 7, 9 is greater than 8. That means from this 10 digit, 9 is the greatest number, num that means 9 is the greatest digit, and 0 is the smallest digit here, okay? And you know that already from the previous class. But my dear students, first of all, we need to identify the place value, okay, for this number given. If we identify the place value, then it is easier for us to arrange in ascending order or in descending order also. Ascending order means smaller to greater. Now, first of all, in the question, we should indicate the place value. This one's position, it's 4739. From this four digit, we will put up the place values number uh, value okay it's ones position it's tens position it's hundreds and then it's thousands okay now again it's ones tens hundreds and this four is in thousands uh, ones tens hundreds and thousands all of the number we will put up one tens hundreds and thousand for your better understand ones tens hundreds thousands my dear students now look it is very easy to arrange in ascending order that means from smaller to greater we will uh, see only the highest place values position highest place values position okay all the number has the highest place value that means thousand okay all the number has the thousand place thousand place thousand place thousand place thousand place now which digit is greater in this highest place look thousands place has four thousands place has four thousands place has four thousands place has four and thousands place has four that means all the highest place value are same so we can't identify the smallest number here so to identify the smallest number go to the next step that means go to the next highest place our next highest place is hundred okay now hundreds place has nine hundred place has nine hundred place has three 100 places 3 and 100 places 7. Now, between these 5, my dear students, 3 is the smallest, right? 3 is the smallest one. But look, there are 2, 3 in the 100 place. So, from these 2, we need to identify which one is the smallest number, okay? Now, from these 2, look, from these 2, we will go to the next place value, okay? Next place value. The next place value of 3 is what? Is 9. And next place value of 3 is 7. That means between these two, 7 is the smallest, right? Between these two, 9 and 7, which is one is smallest? 7 is the smallest. In the tens place position, we have 7. So, 4,379 is our smallest number here. So, write it down. 4,379 is our smallest number here. That means this is done. So, after that, which number will come? Look, after that, this number will appear because this three number is the most smallest number. That is why this is the smallest. So, our next smallest number is 3,900, sorry, 3, uh, 4,397 will be our next number. 4,397. 
4397 will be our next smallest number. Now, my dear students, this two number is already done. Okay. Now, we need to find out the smallest number, the next smallest number from this three. Okay. From this three, look again, it's in the hundreds place. We have nine, we have nine, and we have seven. So, seven and nine we have. That means seven is the smallest number. So, we should write down this number in the third place. That means 4739 will be our next smallest number. It is 4739 okay my dear students this is also done now look only two numbers are remaining here it's 4937 and 4973 both the number has four in the thousands place and nine in the hundred place that means we can't identify from this two place value that is why we should go to the next place value the next place value is three in tens position this has 3 okay and this number second number has 7 in the tens position that means which number which is the smallest 3 or 7 yes my dear students 3 is the smallest 3 is the smallest before 7 3 comes okay that means 3 is the smallest so this is our next smallest number that means 4937 will be our next number okay and this number is done also now my dear students look only one number is remaining here so we can write it down directly in thus ascending order is 4973 that means 4973 is our greatest number here i think my dear student you have understood okay how to solve now i am editing this one my dear students look this is the ascending order ascending order means from smaller to greater already we have arranged this one and my dear students you have a homework on this and your homework number is seven please mention the homework number in your hw copy and you need to solve this one write the following numbers in ascending order you need to put this question on your copy after that write down answer then you need to write down the required ascending order then give a column then you should arrange this number in ascending order that means from smaller to greater okay my dear students and you should submit your homework on every saturday okay my dear students see you again inshallah till then allah face